Hey, what's up everybody? This is BSL, but it's closer to BSL Gaming here, and uh, this is mainly just a tutorial on how to, essentially, how to record commentary, just the audio, using Adobe Audition in kind of conjunction with the Elgato Sound Capture. This is for recording commentary so that you can still kind of have sound playing in the background, and it won't, it'll only record your commentary. This can be used on Skype, Discord, or I believe just anything that supports mul supports multiple sound capturing. I guess you could put it that way. Anyway, first thing you want to do uh, with Elgato Sound Capture, which should be on here, I'll be kind of transitioning between them. To get out Elgato Sound Capture, open it up and click on Team Chat. Now. Once you do that, go down to settings down here, and it says, what's your microphone for chat? In this case, it's my blue snowball. So set it to that, and where do you want to hear your friend's voice? Choose whatever your main sound output is, which in my case is uh, my headset. Now, once you do that, next thing you want to do is go into Skype or Discord. So excuse me a second. Okay then, uh, next thing you want to do is go into your Discord set, Skype or Discord settings, just wherever your sound settings are, in which case I'm choosing Discord, my voice, and go to voice, or if you have it yet, because they're still rolling this out, voice and video, and set your input device to whatever your microphone is, and then you want to set the output device to Elgato, Elgato Sound Capture, and that's pretty much all you want to do right there. Now excuse me while I go into Adobe Audition. Okay, so now I'm here in Adobe Audition, and what you want to do is essentially, I guess first thing you want to do is make sure that your audio is set up here, so go to Edit, Audio Hardware Setup. Uh, I guess your default input would be your microphone, and the default output would be Elgato Sound Capture. Now, if, if neither of those options for some reason show up, then click on Control Panel, and then just click the little X on the square in which you're... Uh, in which the input and outputs that you want to use are. Then just click OK. Once you do that, they should appear it I know I just okay. They should appear and now what you want to do then is to actually record, click on multi-track, uh, choose a name for the session. And then what you want to do is either for track one or two, just uh Click the little arrow right here and then choose either your microphone or Elgato Sound Capture and then and then set track two to either to the other one, which would be either Blue Snowball or Elgato Sound Capture. I have track one is the Blue Snowball and track two is Elgato Sound Capture. Now, once you did all that, everything should essentially be set. Then just click the record button. Then you can just click the record button and as it is capturing my voice, uh, I don't have anything going on in Discord, but it would show up on track two, the sound waves, whatever you're, you have, uh, yeah, I think you know what I'm talking about at this point. Once you're done recording, just press the stop button down here, and then after you do that, do not forget to do this, click export, audio mix down, and set it to whatever, choose a file name, and then just click save. It'll export to wherever you save it to and boom, there you go. You can record your microphone and just Discord so that you can have other sounds playing in the background and it will not record said thing. Cause trust me, I use this for clusterfuck comms, I use this for the game industrials. I use it a lot. Anyway, this tutorial is actually mainly for Clusterfuck comms, for certain members of Clusterfuck comms, so that's kind of the reason why I'm making this video. So, that's how you do the thing. Until next time, BSL out.